In today's show, we have a story on useless stuff, Civil War operations, and Minute Bell music. Hey guys, I'm Madison. And I'm Kaylee, and you're watching SVTV. We are making stories by teens for teens. Creating a platform, finding character, and giving others a voice. This is SVTV. If you walk by McAllister's room, you'll see something cool. Nick and McKenna caught up to find out more. Students in the Civil War class are sawing and smashing their way into learning. So today we're, we're performing, we're acting out Civil War surgeries. So each group is in a four-person team, one-person surgeon, surgical assistant, soldier, and narrator. And their job is to accurately perform a Civil War surgery. Um, to do this, we have cow legs, which simulate human bones, and we use a sledgehammer to simulate the Civil War bullets, and then sledgehammer meets bone, and we get to show the impact of the bullets and then perform the surgery. I personally think it was fun, but it also kind of helped me realize about how different it is nowadays and like how they didn't really know what they were doing. Uh, I personally think the amputating is really cool and fun and it's a good experience. During this process, students learned that doctors gave the soldiers chloroform before surgeries. Uh, part of what we're teaching is just what a Civil War soldier would go through, a little empathy and on a daily basis um, or after a battle. Secondly is to, again, debunk some of those myths. We don't want to want people to, to go away with just mythology or folklore, but actual facts about what a Civil War surgery was like. The students got to experience and learn what it would be like to do an amputation during the Civil War. Sounds cool. Now on to the announcements. Did you know that all the Minute Bell music is posted on Twitter? Ali caught up with Mr. Crummy to find out more about it. Hey Vikes, I'm here with Mr. Crummy to talk about the SHS Minute Bell Twitter. So why should students follow it? Okay, so following the SHS Minute Bell Twitter gives you access to information about the song of the day. If you didn't catch like what the song was, uh, we always um, put in background, a little bit of background about the bands, about the song itself, a link to uh, YouTube, usually the music video of the song, and then a few other things like that. So if you want to know more about the artist or the music, um, follow SHS Minute Bell. It's at, at SHS Bell. <laughs> Awesome. Make sure and follow that. Now back to your anchors. Make sure to follow SHS Bell. FBLA is starting a trivia contest. The students who answer this question correctly and report to Mr. Hoffman's room will be entered in a drawing for a prize. The question is, what day is American Enterprise Day on? Now here's Kaylee with the sports. There's a lot going on. Friday, there's a girls' soccer informational meeting with Coach Diedrich and WA after school. Also, Hunter Hesseltine will sign a letter of intent to play baseball at Barton County Community College. State is, Saturday, State is Saturday for the SHS cheer team. Performance starts at 4.30 at the Expo. Cost is $5 for parking and 10 for entrance. Come support the ones who support you. On Monday, Blaine Jepson will sign a letter of intent to play baseball at Washburn University. That's all for sports. Let's go check out the weather. Seaman students should enroll in challenging courses such as Honors English. Always be engaged in the activity and show self-control. Also, follow classroom policies and procedures. Be considerate of others' opinions and collaborate with others to problem solve. Treat school property with respect. Complete work on time. Be a Viking. And an engaged student. Seaman Strong. What's up guys? It's your guy Elias Mosier here and hey, I got a great product for you. It's called SVTV Live Streaming, okay? We want to get this done so we can see all those sports like go touchdown bowl, man. Like get a strike, my dude, and golf. Like, you know, these great sports. If you want to see them live, all you got to do is go down and hit that subscribe button. Just 
smash that subscribe button, guys. Don't forget to turn on that bell notification and like the video. Thanks, guy. See you later. Hey, I'm gonna go home and watch some Disney Plus. See you tomorrow. Be safe, there's supposed to be a nasty storm. The high for today is 47, the low is 30. Friday is gonna be 37 with a chance of snow and it's supposed to warm up Saturday and Sunday. Now back to your anchors. Yesterday was use less stuff day. Here's what we found people would use less of. Today is National Use Less Stuff Day. We went around the school to see what people could use less of. What's one thing you can live without and why? Country music. It hurts my ears. Uh, I'd have to say my phone because uh, I don't have one because it broke. So yeah. What's one thing you can live without and why? Balloons because they pop and it scares me. What's one thing you can live without and why? Cats because they're my least favorite animal. That's it for National Use Less Stuff Day. Have a good rest of your day. Don't forget to answer the trivia question for FBLA. That's all for today, Vikes. Have a great rest of your day.